Hi friends, welcome to Tech ARK IT YouTube channel. In this video session, we are going to see about else if, else if, if in the sense else. So uh, in this session, uh, actually previous sessions, we already see that um, if statement are the conditional statement where we make the decisions based on the um, that condition is false or true. So then do something. So after that, we also see that if else statement like uh, if statement or if else statement can only execute one or two conditions, which is false or true statements like if one condition is true, then execute the uh, true block. If one condition is false, then execute the statement is uh, false, then uh, execute the false statement. But whereas if you want to uh, validate or if you want to take a decision based on a multiple uh, conditions, then you can use the if else uh, statement over here. So the if else statement, I'm going to give you a, a one example or how a if else statement can be uh, run if else if okay so then in this condition what we are going to do is that if okay so we are going to run some condition over here then if that condition is true or it is matched or thing then execute these commands okay else else if again i am writing one more condition over here that condition one so if condition one is true, then execute below. Okay. Uh, or else, again, I'm going to verify that if uh, above condition is uh, one condition is not true or condition one is not true, then I'm writing condition two that, okay, if condition is true, condition two is true, then execute these commands. Okay else if else then if all the conditions are not true then execute this else statement so we are we can write a number of n number of else if statements like if you not condition one is not true then execute condition two if condition is not condition two is not true then execute condition three or condition three is not true then execute condition four so continuously checks wherever the condition is true then it execute that block until unless your statement is not true all the statements are false then it is going to execute a else statement in the end of the else statement so this is the if else how we can write it so i'm going to create a template saying that um, if else if okay if else if is the sorry okay i'm going to edit if else if statement so in this statement what we are going to do here is that we are going to provide any four numbers that uh, out of four numbers among the four numbers which number is biggest one so uh, i'm asking the users to provide some four numbers then based on that what i'm uh, telling that the users that so which number is biggest among the four numbers so we are writing that find biggest number among four digits so i'm going to provide four digit num four numbers are the four digit numbers then i'm going to tell that okay this is the biggest number you have provided out of four numbers okay so the first one is i'm going to say is that um, uh, please enter uh, values or please enter four values okay followed by space so we have to tell the users clearly saying that okay what we want from them or else uh, they may confuse so they, the script may not going to be executed as like as 
okay and i am going to read the values okay the first one is the a value okay the second one is the b value and the third one is the c value sorry i'm storing into the c always okay and i'm going to store into d so i'm storing these values into a b c d as a variable values then i'm going to say if so here it should must be space within the brackets same dollar a if it is greater than dollar b and i'm going to use a logical and operator over here dollar a greater than dollar c okay and i'm going to say dollar a greater than dollar d so what i'm going to do here is that i'm verifying that whether dollar a is greater than b and dollar a and operator in the sense which means that first condition should be true second condition should be true and third condition should be true then only this if block is going to be executed okay so this block is going to be executed if all of these uh, statements are true then i am going to say that echo so dollar a a is big okay so like this you can say like this you can say that okay so if that is matching in the sense dollar a is uh, bigger than b and dollar a is bigger than c and dollar is dollar a is bigger than d in the sense all these three statements should be true then it is going to be execute this block if not then it's not going it's going to be going to the another block checking for the else if condition so else if i am writing again this um, uh, second one is that dollar b is greater than dollar c okay and dollar b is greater than dollar d so it is going to be verified with that the second one say if the dollar value whatever the dollar b values is greater than c and greater than d and it's going to be executed over here this block is going to be executed over here i am saying here dollar b is a big okay and again i am going to write one more else if condition saying that here i am validating the dollar c value with greater than dollar d or not okay then it's going to be executed the value is that below echo i am going to write is that dollar c c sorry dollar c is big sorry here this one is b1 okay big is else i am saying else echo dollar d d is big fi so i am explaining this come this script again over here i am going to capture a four values from the users saying that enter four values by spaces followed by the spaces so they are going to enter four values any values which they are going to execute and in the first attempt i am going to validate the user input saying that first value whatever they provided is that dollar a e is greater than b and greater than c and greater than d if this is condition is true then it's going to execute this statement okay if this statement is any one of the statement is false then it's going to be execute the next block this block if block and condition it verify that if the dollar b is bigger than c and b is bigger than d then it's going to execute this block or else it's going to pass to the next condition saying that okay if dollar c is greater than dollar d then it's going to be execute the c value or else the d value is going to be shown is that the d value is the bigger value than the all the four values so this is our um, command this is our script then we are going to execute this script and say verify that 
how our script else if statement works okay here i am saying that 4 5 6 7 so which means that the 7 value is going to be a bigger value and it's going to say that sorry okay 4 5 6 7 and it's going to be verified these values sorry sorry okay um, if else if such if else if and I'm going to enter the value 1 value 2 value 3 value 4 so the seven D value is the bigger value okay so this one little bit confusing over here then we are going to add uh, all these uh, uh, values example say I say copy this one and paste over here and uh, paste over here paste over here so we are going to ask the values four times to the users okay saying that please enter a value no spaces okay so I'm not cal calculating any positional parameters over here so that a mistake in a enter a B value okay maybe enter a C value and I am asking that again enter D value so I am going to ask the users to enter the values four times so which means to be sh if else if and I say enter the value so I am saying that uh, this time A should be a bigger than all these values I am entering 9 and the B value should be uh, 8 and the C value should be 4 and the D value should be 4 so say 9 A value is a bigger value so that is exactly correct so again I am going to ex uh, enter the values at this time I am going to say C value to be in a bigger value okay so I am entering the value into something like that uh, C value would be 4 and the B value would be 2 and the um, C value would be uh, 8 and the D value would be 1 so that C is a bigger value than the among the all the four numbers this is about the if else statement so once again I am going to explain this if else statement over here so the first of all we are going to ask the users to enter four values out of that we are going to validate this uh, first statement using the and op logical and operator saying that if all these statements are true then it's going to be execute the first one if this statement is true then it's going to execute second one if this value is true then it's going to be execute this block if all of these values are not true then it's going to be execute the else statement so that's about this um, I hope you understand else if uh, statement else if if else if statement so thanks for watching stay tuned Please subscribe to the channel for more upcoming videos or upcoming courses.